one team looking for revenge and the other looking for the sweep. Many people already know about her, but she is going to throw gas. She the second baseman set to lead things off, and we're underway. First pitch up high, and a beautiful day half fitting, but you like what they bring. Uh, ...chance of winning, and then if they score in that first inning, 57% chance, so Gamecocks need to keep them off the bases. You see the Clemson lineup we told you about. ...really have a chance to set a tone because things got out of hand so quickly, and you can see things... ...Clemson lineup, there's not a lot of holes in it, and of course... Uh, ...you kind of see the strength of hitter fall kind of towards you get when you get to the back, but I tell you how much of an impact player Cagle has been. I mean, go watch... ...against the Gamecocks two weeks ago. Is, again, is just trying to be very careful about where she plays. Slow roller to second. Sellers is there and can't come up with the play. But you also have to wonder if there's some nerves. I mean, this is a big in. Here's Caroline Jacobson. Slow roller to short. Flips the short way, and the Gamecocks get out of the inning without any damage. No CC selection, and through two no-hitters last season, baseman, as they've got some depth behind the plate. You see her number. Lead off hitter. It doesn't matter how they're getting on. You just want them on to set the table for the others coming behind. For the grad student out of Hanahan, South Carolina. There's that change up from Thompson. Effective this season. Actually, Cummings a junior transfer. Transfer. In the top ten in the SEC with nine doubles and 26 walks. Pack 12 athlete and you need someone solid behind the stays alive Gamecocks obviously would like to get something going early they'll take a base runner any way they can get one they only had to the first game I mean it was a loss for South Carolina but at the same time it's kind of like a, a wash Gamecock to hit over 200 the last five games and see if she can this season send her for extra bases Let's see what they do with Cummings. She's coming around third. Here comes the throw. It's not a good one, and the Gamecocks strike first. It was really good, and for Bland Pete, that was such a nice piece of hitting. The throw from the outfield was not a good one coming in. Kind of momentarily. And joining us in the booth today is Alan Rigg. Back, which is a D3 conference up in the Virginias and Carolinas. One-two pitch through the hole into left field for a base hit. Bland Pete around third. Here comes the throw. Not in time. Game. This is just what the doctor ordered after a rough night. Orders has made things difficult. A walk, a double, and a single. You have to make a quick decision. This one will stay fair for Davenport, the third baseman, inning over. it. actually saw her do that uh, against Florida. And you can hit for power and also good wheels on the bases. Got 29 career homes. And Clemson, actually, their record is five. And take a look at what your sport media people are doing. Logaleo fans for the first out in the inning. Third strikeout first inning was, I think, a big deal. Left field. It'll drop in for a base hit. Could be extra bases. But coming over was the center fielder, Aaliyah White, to back up Riley. Bl over at first has not attempted a stolen base this year. There's the number. Strike quickly. And just like that, she plunks the batter, and that puts a runner in scoring position. For it's up, and you know you can have a multitude of things with a hit. Not bunting here, and takes another strike. Good crowd here today. A lot of folks from the upstate of driver at the schools, and so you have to give credit. The fan base just kind of came on over. Big punch out there from lineup. The senior having a tremendous year. And they, they got a taste with Florida State at Clemson last weekend. Um, and obviously, you know, the outcome. 85 with 23 runs batted in. with run And if you're throwing the ball well and you can hit that spot and they're not doing anything, go for it. Popped up right side of the infield. Sellers is there, inning over. The Tigers threaten, but don't. Boy, that's a, looks like a whole lot of Dr. Megan Matthews bunning second base. In her second season here in Columbia. Back where it came from, and the Gamecocks have their third hit of the day. Solid single up the middle for Desider, a Gatorade High School Player of the Year. Under the glove of the third baseman, Davenport. Everybody's safe. Hard hit shot with the third baseman, Reedy. If she gets it down, she's always a threat to beat it out as well. Well, no, really, I, I don't, I mean, I'm going to say this, it's going to sound weird, but I like that. 
in the field to be that way for the opposing team. Big punch out here for Brooke McCubbin. Her first Jordan Fabian, the first baseman. He looked at strike three last day. Roped foul, and McCubbin working ahead here. Ball on two. Good test for Clemson to see how they'll challenge, but that's the thing is that. The knee to the bottom of the sternum, and it must touch the plate. There you go. Um, Ellison behind the plate. He is a very experienced World Series. This is loaded one out. Squibbed left side. Throw to the plate in time. Good play by the shortstop. Logalea prevents a possible beginning for the Gamecocks. The thing she brought up was leaving early. Um, unfortunately, it didn't. Or excuse me, a reviewable um, play. Uh, has a staff of former umpires and current umpires that actually sit and review. Swing and a miss, strike three. Fifth strikeout for Donnie. Coach Rittman. <laughs> Go burn ahead here, a ball and two. I'm put my South Carolina hat on here for a second <laughs> as an alum, but I wish that she would work, make her throw more pitches. They're hoping that it's going to wear her down. It's going to put her to the test. And there's the first walk by. Hurt you doesn't lose the game for you, even though it's still early in the game. Falls behind 3-0. and and Kegel being very cool. She's not up there necessarily to get singles and walks. Runner goes, hitting the air line, makes the grab, and there's a huge second out. Jacobson out of Tallahassee, Florida. Right now. Hit into left. be made by Bland Peed. Runner around third. She will score. And the Tigers have split the difference. After Jacobson swung something over her head, but you got to get. Here's Aaliyah Logaleo, the shortstop. Or, now obviously it's easy to look back on that and say, but he talked about this. Yep. They're being patient. They're making Donnie work. Sky to left, fighting the sun as Riley Blampede in foul territory makes the grab, and that'll it came in relief last inning of Millie Thompson. That was a, a look at McCubbin's changeup. We've seen. Hit in the air to center field, but playable for Mackenzie Clark. And there's the first out. Lampede, second leading hitter for the game. Cox coming into the rival. <laughs> Rounded to short. Logaleo is there. Two away. Tops in the ACC and fielding from Georgia. Far McCubbin has done a really nice job coming in. You can see her. Gamecocks down in order for the first time. And they'll do it with a strikeout as Black goes down swinging. Second strikeout for McCubbin. Bottom half of the third. Maybe a little momentum swing here in this con. Abby Vieira, the catcher, to lead things off. And did that hit her? It did. So let's talk about <laughs> that. <laughs> her off and running pretty quickly here. So she has it. Because now they have to do things faster. Swing and a miss, strike three, and go opening. I think again, it just highlights the fact that up and down the lineup. Strike three called, and after the hit by pitch, later a race. For seven, throwing first pitch strikes against her opponent. The shelter and relief supplies. Bunt put down by Gonzalez, throw to first, it hits the runner. And she'll have to retreat back to first base. So a snip up. out of the running lane. All right, Gonzalez is going to be out. There you go. Gamecocks have had some unfortunate base running gaffes on their part today. That People are in the stands, and this is a full. JoJo Hyatt, you just saw the graphic there, the new catcher in the game for the Tigers. As Desiderio sends a grounder to Davenport at third, two away. Trying not to do the same here as McCubbin's done a really nice job of setting. Where's the bunt? Pushed it foul. A run on two hits for the t Brought it four years ago. But 2-2, <laughs> two slow roller to Davenport again. Long throw across the diamond in time. And for the second straight inning, the game says we head to the fifth here in Columbia. Great. But her job is to make sure that the athletes are receiving um, you know, what they need to receive. And that brings the Tigers back to the top of the order. You got a pinch runner there. Houston with three stolen bases on the year. Bring it out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, we work. They also work on their mental game, and they have programs that they follow. 
popped up. Shortstop Blankenship is there after six balls were fouled off for the Tigers back in the third inning. Yeah, and if nothing, absolutely. 1-0 popped up out of play. Because you certainly failure, but for at least more stress, in my opinion. And just replay the entire better. What could I have done different? Um, did I miss this? I missed that. And through plays, we talked through, you know, what we could have done. Most dangerous hitters in this Clemson lineup, you see. And you can slow, we actually saw Goborn do it in the first couple at-bats. Is she slowed up? But you know what? If you're going to pitch to her, you're going to own. 2-2. Two, two. Wow. Look what look what <laughs> Goburn found. Inning over. Way to field here. For nothing doing for the Tigers in the fifth. Coming. He came in in the second inning in relief of Millie Thompson. It's Hannah Hawley, the freshman. First pitch swinging. And handled easily by Keller and quickly went away. Carolina, you see the average this year. She got off to a tremendously slow. Checked her swing and fouled it off on the pitch. Base. Get it off of you. Clemson's defense. Popped up right side. Who wants it? First baseman. Two away. Kelly Blankenship. Blankenship look. Two hopper to Davenport at third. She's got it. Inning over. Third straight inning. The Gamecocks are retired in order. One for two today. You see her numbers. So humble. It's so professional. It's fine, Brad. Remember, we throw those wild pitches sometimes. Doing some great things uh, at Stanford. Different weather and just how kind people were. But that's budgets. There's Title IX, all that kind of stuff. And for years, they never would consider softball. 2-2 two -two pitch, sky to Aaliyah White. New as well. Exactly, yep. Yep. exactly. And so softball, at she has one of the fun. Tigers get a runner aboard here with one out in the sixth. Yeah, this is the third time through the lineup for her. And, and swipes. Gets a bunt down. Fabian makes the play. They get the out with Sellers covering the bag. And an opportunity here to knock things up. Hmm, tell us more. <laughs> Well, we'll have to get yeah. it next inning as Coburn gets Brooke McCubbin, who's been spectacular, had pitched uh, just for a stadium, <laughs> which is not my problem. <laughs> just a little small. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Cummings up one in the last ten of left the infield. Yeah. <laughs> a little light reading. Payoff pitch, hammered into right field. That'll drop in, throw to first, not in time. And the game stealing bases this year. Blampede at the plate. Good play by Keller at first. No chance at second to get the speedy Ricks. Cox leading it two to one, runner at second. More in a moment. Off speed, so pretty tricky. You see the number. Good, and she throws in that high speed. Hit but, to right, yeah. Jacobson goes back, makes a running grab, and Ricks might Double be doubled off at second. Yeah. I'm looking. Some speed in that left-handed hitter's box. Mentally <laughs> and know how to regulate those emotions. Quickly 0-2 here, well, but just off the plate. So depending, how about that? Yes. 1-2 pitch, that's up the middle for a base hit. A slap single, the shortstop Blankenship was plant two, a single through the left side in her last trip. Quickly 0-2. I can see that the mix in her change up, and you know, not a bad miss, she's up 1-2. Hit in the air to center field. Long run for Aaliyah White, and she makes the grab for out number two. In the game. Four pitch walk, and the Tigers kicking up their heels here in the seventh. One two pitch, hit to left field. Blampede back to the warning track to the wall. It's gone. And the Tigers have taken over with their 15th home run. And just like that, the Tigers have strike and Cagle blasts one to left. This one popped up left side. Shortstop Blankenship will call and catch, inning over. But the damage side of the baseline and was ruled out. So 0 for 2 today. Two. Miklesh back to the wall, touch him off. That's 
is the response you want to see, and that's from your sixth hitter because they have Donnie Goborn. So they're used to seeing the speed on top of what they see. Extra base hit allowed by Cagle this season. Slow roller to short. Logalelo's up there. She's got it. Throw gets away. And diving back to has two sacrifice hits on the season. Chopper to Davenport. Goes to second for one. Relay to first. Not in time. Carolina here. One out in the seventh. A run in on the solo shot by Gun. 2 2 pitch. Grounded left side. Logalelo to second for one. Relay to first. Way over the first uh -oh. baseman's head. Game at second base. Umpires discussing what they saw. Improve upon. So the Tigers win it four to three.